All right, what is going on everybody? Captain here, back with another Marvel Contest of Champions video. Today, I'm going to be spending up my scraps. I've been collecting them ever since this event started. I haven't spent a single one. I've collected all of my keys, and I'll show you guys how I've collected all that scrap and all those keys in case you guys are not aware. Uh, it's pretty self-explanatory, but to start, I went ahead and I've completed every single quest. I did beginner, normal, uh, heroic and then master you can see all of them are 100% there uh, so that is from let's see from master mode you get 80,000 heroic you get what is that 60 yeah 60,000 then 40,000 and another 20,000 so however much that adds up to all together is how much you get from the quests I didn't take the time to add that up you guys can do that also from this scrapyard here you get them if you complete each one on each difficulty and so far every round that this has come out I've completed it and each one you get another thousand and again I'm not sure exactly how many rounds have come from that and there was a post originally when it further this event all came first came out that told you guys how much you got so you probably already know that you're aware of how much you can get um, so if you haven't got that yet guys I would advise you get in there we still got a little over seven days so basically a week left to complete these things uh to gather more shards and everything and so obviously between now and then i'll be gaining a little bit more from doing the daily quests but i have a bulk of all of them that i'm going to be doing and what i'm going to be spending mine on is going to be in related to what i have coming up on my channel uh, so let's go ahead hop over to my inventory and i'll show you how many how much scraps i have as well as how many keys i've gathered so again the keys you get from those daily quests as well i forgot to mention that they're kind of random so here i have 10 of them if i click on it there you go you can see you got 10 uh, so i've gotten i guess pretty lucky with that i don't i don't know at this point probably a lot of people have gotten more than that uh, 286,000 of the scraps and then yes guys I still have my button do not press the death button we're gonna be finding out here shortly what we're gonna get from that uh, so that'll be exciting but enough wasting time let's go ahead jump over into the scrapyard and see what we're doing here all right so here we are at the scrapyard I forgot to get up my little cheat sheet this tells me which each of these crystals are so I had to take a quick pause there uh, but here we go in this first run first run we can either go straight down the middle and take nothing, or we can get, let's see if I get these ones right. This one over on the right here is the tier two catalyst. Uh, this one's a gold, this is the tier one, and then this is a premium. So out of those ones, I'm probably gonna be going to the tier twos because most of you know that they're just kind of annoying to collect. It, they're really rare in a weird, oddly way. So this is a good way to get those, and they're only 300 scraps. And so I can get a couple of those that will prevent, that won't prevent me from getting what I want. Uh, so mainly though, the things I'm going to be getting, uh, I guess if we look into the second one, we've got a three star crystal, the stony mastery core, an alpha catalyst, a tier one, and then a uh, tier, I believe this is a tier three catalyst, class catalyst that is. Um, so for that one, we're probably going to be getting a couple, picking up a couple stony mastery cores. And then for the final one, we've got obviously the big one, the four star. Actually, this isn't the final one. Excuse me, this is the third one. We got the four star crystal. Yeah, we got the four star crystal, carbonadium cores, and uh, the ascendant crystal. I think that is, and then the tier four catalysts. So the two four basic catalyst is pretty good. A lot of people are probably going to be going for that. Uh, but I think the main one that people are going to be getting is the carbonadium core if they need their masteries. But for me. I'm pretty satisfied with my masteries at the moment, so I'm going to be picking up two of these four stars from here. A lot of people will probably think I'm stupid and I'm wasting my scraps, but like I said, my masteries, I'm pretty happy with my setup, so uh, I don't need anything else other than the four stars. And then moving on to the final uh, little uh, paths here, we have where the keys come in. In the middle, you have a title that is like, I have heard it's Rocket's Little Helper or something like that for five keys. Or on the left, you can get 150 four-star shards, or on the far right is uh, 25 four-star shards. So for me, I think I'm going to be spending all 10 of my keys on the four-star shards, so I'll be getting 300 more shards there. Um, again, all this is to build up toward my big four-star crystal opening. I'm trying to get as many as I can. I really want to get to 20. Right now, doing the math, I think I'm maxed out at like 19 unless i go hard and complete a couple things so uh, we'll see what happens but these will definitely help all right so here we go let's go ahead and do this first one 
and we'll go over to the right and we will pick up the yes we want to open that pick up the tier two alpha uh, tier two class catalyst correction uh there we go got the first one and then for this next one we want to grab the stony mastery core because you know i mean three star twenty thousand isn't worth it stony mastery core is actually worth it i don't need any of those things over there so stony mastery core i might end up using it here and there might be a few things I still need to change around, I guess. Uh, but carbonadium core I don't need, so let's go ahead. And the final one, well, not not the final again, the correction. Pick up the four star. There we go, and boom, fully formed four star crystal. Can't wait to open it, guys. Not gonna be opening it until like next week, though, after the uh, first round of the Voodoo Arena, assuming I get him in the first round. Hopefully I do, um, but we'll see what happens. Uh, and let's go ahead and spend our keys. Get five of them. There we go. And I guess we don't find out what it is until the end, but pretty sure it is 125 four star shards. So we'll go ahead and might as well take Thor, get the class advantage. It's going to be a tough fight here, guys. I don't know if I'm going to be able to beat this. Uh, let's see how long this takes me. Whew. That was a nail biter. That was a close one, guys. And there you go, you can see the rewards. Got the tier two class catalyst, stony mastery core, four star hero crystal, 150 shards. And you can see total we have 300, or sorry, 300, uh, 33,657. So we're sitting on 16 right now. And uh, I think, so this, this one here makes 17. And let's pick up number 18. All right, here we go. We took the exact same path as the last round. Uh, same rewards. Pick up the four-star crystal. So that is number 18 for the four-star heroes. And um, I don't know. Maybe we will get to 20 pretty easily. I'm not sure yet, guys. Um, I'm hoping. I'm hoping. Pick up this last one. And then we will be done here. All right, so that's going to do it. Uh, there you go. You can see you got the exact same rewards as last time. Um, tier 2, Stony Mastery Core, 4 star, and then the shards um, brings us up a little bit more. So that's going to do it guys. Let me know what you guys spent your shards on in the comments down below. I'm interested to see what most people are spending them on. I'm guessing a lot of you are getting cores or the 4 star crystal. Uh, so thank you for watching and I will catch you next time.